Hello there everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover and thank you for rejoining me here in Equestria at War playing as the Grand Prince of Baltia of Lake City. Last time, we took out uh, the nations to our west and northwest, including Hellquill, which I asked you guys yesterday whether we should release these nations or not. And there's pretty much overwhelming absolute support for me to not do that. Because apparently, according to you guys, Hellquill has the ability, whether they are a puppet or free or independent or whatever, that could launch a plague against us, which would not be very good for us. So we're not going to do that. But we are here, and we are poised to, well, at least defend against the River Republic, Vinland, basically the River Coalition, as I take a sip of coffee as we will do our next focus. So we've already done His Heavenly Presence. Well, that's the one we just finished. What we should do next is maybe some land stuff. Obviously, we don't, no longer have Dreams of a Federation here, which is fine. We actually did it. Ooh, we actually have a navy focus. That's different. Okay, cool. But we can do divine sacrifice. Death should be seen as an honorable sacrifice to make for your grand prince. It's also a sacrifice which will be greatly rewarded. For as your mortal life ends, you will soon discover that the next offers a whole new realm in which to serve his majesty. Your mortal soul is merely a prologue, prologue to an eternity of service and rewards. We can use kamikaze strikes. And last stand, of course, attack command abilities at a much cheaper price, which is a very, very good thing for us, but it is almost 10, 13, my friends, almost. And honestly, we're still out of pony power. I don't want to do this, but I think I have to go to a service bar requirement. Just before we go to war with these guys, we've got to get more manpower somehow, pony power. Oh my goodness. Also, I did take 13 divisions away from Diamond Mountain, which will suit us okay-like. When we go to war with all these guys up here, I do want to make sure we have a good enough army, though, or Air Force, really, as well. It's emerging mental combat teams. It's just going to take some time for us to really get in a good position to go to war with these guys. Uh, plane wise, we're doing okay. We could do be better. We could be doing better on that. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's so not good. Falkorian Workers Union has capitulated. That's good. Uncertain times. Very good. Let's get up to three. Oh god. And there goes their pony power once again. As we're all training here together. Ooh, rubber processing, processing, that's very nice. We still could use a little bit more rubber. But happy 1013, my friends. It's a new year. Maybe new us. Let's grab some advanced competing machines. It was recommended in yesterday's video from, like, comments that I actually use more light divisions. Because these are, like, motorized, but probably better, so it said. Uh, yeah, they look so far a little better from what I'm seeing. 4.6 breakthrough, 5.9. We might as well make these guys a little bit faster, I suppose. 20 combat width. That shouldn't hurt us, right? Field hospitals, maybe. Engineers. Artillery. Will actually make them somewhat kind of good. Actually, what... Uh, do these anything special? Not really. Cool. Greifwald declared war on the city of Floena. So be it, so be it. We can only get 1.4 political power a day, which is nice. We'll still need to do modern fa farming modernization. As well as continuing to improve our... Military capabilities. Oh, are we, are we actually out of stuff? No, we're not. So, I want to make more tactical bombers and fighters. That'll probably help us out quite a bit. We have another division. Oh, more from Diamond City. Or Diamond Mountain, really. This coffee's pretty good. Ah, good. And we also have military police, which would be great. Great, 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 great. I'm actually going to go, go get the next one immediately. Just because we want to put as much suppression on uh, those guys that we took out last time. Over here, so let's see. Occupy territories, divine sacrifice. Uh, it's getting okay. Civilian. Is there anything better than civilian oversight? No, not really. That kind of sucks. Divine sacrifice is good. So we're down, done down here. Basically, we have to go to war with the Federation next. But I want to at least get to revolutionize the army. But let's import Pegasus Doctrine. The Pegasus Battalions of Nimbusia are some of the best combat formations in the entire River Coalition. They strike hard, fast, with great effectiveness, easily devastating all their opponents. It may prove beneficial to send an attaché to study the Nimbusia army and better understand and replicate their successes. Well, I don't really know how much they really want us to study their army since we left the Federation, so... We'll see. Darnish Highlands. Yeah, I definitely want to make a bigger army before we go to war because they're stacking bodies now. And even though I know that my own personal army should be able to hold out for the most part since they're 40 combat width, all across the rest of the line, they're probably not going to be able to hold that effectively. So I'm going to make sure we get enough soldiers first. 
I do not want to cause a war that we're not ready for. Really don't want to do that. We do need a little bit more rubber. So actually, I will trade away for one rubber. Thank you. And we're going to do that. And then we're going to do that. Because we don't need that much motorized right now. We will make more planes. Please make more planes. Aluminum, yes. And did we do aluminum stuff last time? It looks like we might have. Go and do this. We might as well get it. And grab one. Ooh. No one has aluminum that we can get. Oh, boy. Ooh. Well, I guess this is what we got to do. It's not eight. I would much prefer eight, but whatever. Uh, fighters. Ooh. Ooh. Mm -hmm. What else do we have? Nothing else, really. Ah. Uh, we have enough artillery. Well, we have a good amount of artillery. Just need more planes in general. Maybe. And let's build up some more refineries as well, just in case. There you go. Always continue building up more infrastructure. That'll be good. Oh, God. I just don't want to go to war with these guys and start losing. Actually, if that's the case, we can probably start building up some land forts around here. Oh, they already have some land forts. That's kind of nice. Fine. It lowers their autonomy too, which is not bad. Apparently, apparently, uh, since I asked you guys yesterday whether I should, like, what was it? Ooh, armored cars. That's awesome, actually. Uh, whether I should puppet the territory that we took yesterday. You guys said no, because eventually we get cores on it through when we become the Holy Pony, Pony Empire. So, we'll see what happens. Let's get some support weapons forward, just because I want to get more defense first before anything else. Ooh, Pegasus Doctrine, that's good. Um, I'm going to leave you out of this for now, because I'm not really sure where the parts of the line are going to break. Uh, more attack and defense, that's not bad, that's good, Azure, that'd be good. So we'll see what happens, develop some small arms though. Infantry formations are the backbone of Lake City's army, as such we must prioritize developing advanced small arms in order to increase the effectiveness of these units, which would be a good thing. So I'm going to leave these guys kind of as a fallback army, just so they can reinforce positions that'll be weak. I know that this army here in the center is going to be weak anyways. It's still going to be made up of conscripts from our pu puppets, but if we can, you know, have some 40 combat with divisions to help us out in other areas, we should be good. Up here, I mean, this is the largest border with anyone here, so we'll see about that. You guys are going to stay up here just in case so these divisions can move around if we need to. Eh, maybe don't, don't rest at the top of the hill. We can make some armored units, basic armored cars, I mean. So that'd be kind of nice, actually. Like City Festival, we do that every year. You might as well uh, earmark some funds. That'd be great. Good, good, good. And we have military police, so you guys... Actually, do that first. I didn't realize I'm not using the right template for this. Garrison divisions, there you go. That's just, that's just 8,000 pony power-ish, maybe. Good for the Empire declared when the Skyfall Republic, good for them. Can we see what these guys, these guys, these ponies are doing? Protect the workers, RCD, RDC investments, electronic stuff, and our Air Force with the army, a theater. No one wants to kill them off. Uh, Broad is still alive. Wow, they're all they're still alive. Wow. Uh, let's go and grab some better guns. That's probably really really important for whatever we do. Put them over here. Keep you like right on the line so that you can reinforce any area that we need that we need to reinforce. We could grab more. Eh, no, that's not bad. Military training. I do want to get some stuff down here though first. Probably artillery designer. Probably still infantry going designer. We could grandeur. Happens every year, every episode so far. So that's fine with me. Let's see. Let's. Ooh. Let's go and grab uh, mechanized offensives. That we get even though we have no tanks, which kind of sucks, but you know it is what it is. We can only afford so much with our current industry. But I'll, I promise by the end of this episode, within the next ten minutes, we'll be at war with the uh, these guys. So. Looking good so far. Oh, what are we missing here? Not enough ponies? Oh. There you go. If you do that, you might... Yeah. Lushi offers a trade deal. The government of the kingdom of Lushi offers us a trade deal. They would like to buy several trains from our country to improve the life of their citizens and further modernize their own country. They're willing to pay a good price for the trains. Oh, uh, you know what? Yeah, why not? For now, that sounds like a good idea. I wonder what we get out of it, though. If I can increase relations with a country that to myself that does not affected or will be affected by these guys, I think that'd be a good thing. I think it'd be a really good thing. All right, we could go, we could go to war. Uh, hmm. I'm gonna go and grab this first though, and then after that we're gonna grab. Actually, probably should have done stuff here. Concealment, enemy air support, gra more ground support would be nice. Develop small arms. 
Let's go and grab revolutionize the army because, well, we're doing uh, superior firepower. Infantry and static battle plans have served our nation well. However, these concepts are rapidly becoming relics. Rather, we must completely revolutionize the manner by which we conduct war by focusing less on infantry and more on big guns, motorized formations, and armored warfare. If, the, if we adapt these philosophies early, there will be little hindering our success on the battlefield. Which is a good thing. Skyfall Republic was annexed. So I'm going to save up a little more political power and then we're going to try to maybe go to war. And see what happens. Maybe it'll be good. Maybe it won't be good. I don't know. Probably not. We'll see what happens. More cryptology. Uh, actually, what are we doing? Uh, we're still building up these forts. Ah, they signed a deal with Prywin. The government of the Kingdom of Lushi has purchased strains in the Prywin Republic. They sent us a polite letter explaining that the Prywin Republic had a bitter deal at the time. It seems like we can't win with them at all. What? What? They're dying to wing the Kingdom of Wing Body. How dare you? Oh, they're f oh they're actually fighting. Oh. Yeah. Huh. These guys aren't killing anybody. What's Cassa doing? Citadel Act. Actually, I could go straight to war with them, but there's no way I could get, actually get down there, so. Hmm. Steel? That's fine with me. Keep making more of that stuff. We've got a good reserve of infantry equipment, even support equipment, artillery, motorized, planes as well. That's not too bad for us then. Nice. Very good. We could kamikaze strike. Excuse me. Excuse me. Kamikaze strike. But we're not going to do that. That'd be a bit too crazy for us to do something like that. I'm going to keep another 100 fighters in storage just in case. Uh, actually, I'm going to leave you guys here like this, maybe. It looks like they have enough coverage to hit anywhere they really need to. Screw it. I'm going to deploy another one then. There you go. You know what? I'll have you all trained for now then. See if we can get any more XP for now. That'd be fine. Uh, that should help us out. I want to get it. Three more divisions, maybe three more. Three more divisions, maybe. Let's see what happens. I don't know. The more bodies they stack on the line, I get more and more worried. <clears throat> well, let's see. Battery is. This one's definitely going to hit quite a bit. At least we're lowering their autonomy. That's good. Uh, da, da, dee, 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 dee. Well, keep building. It should take too long. Yeah, it takes like a week to build that stuff up. That's not bad, actually. Revolutionize the army. That's good. Establish Lake City Air Force. Division. Motorized. Oh, let's grab this one. Tungsten bullets. Griffin Knights are known to wear a hefty set of battle armor, which is resistant to the lead-tipped bullets commonly used by our infantry. However, tests have shown that a new tungsten-tipped round is far more effective at punching through this hardy gear. As such, we've begun to produce these rounds on in mass, distributing them quickly through our ranks. So we get plus 7% more heart attack, but plus 2% more soft attack, which is nice as well. Good, another really thick division. I'm going to station you guys, like... Basically, you're going to get hit really hard up here. So we're going to keep them like that there. That'd be good. Oh, I already know this war is going to be terrible for us. It's going to be absolutely god-awful, probably. Let's get 150 political power first. Got another division. Good. I'm going to keep you guys about right... Oh... Here-ish? Because these guys are going to get hit pretty hard, too, probably, I bet. Uh, let's see. It's 10-13. We could do some magical equipment, but we don't really have the capabilities of producing that. Grab some more entrenchment. That's going to be very, very important. Uh, actually, I'm going to push you up just a little bit more first. There's a river here, which is kind of nice. Good, that's done. Uh, grab some more recon. We already have recon on our soldiers, so even more recon would be probably a good idea. There we go. Doing okay with that stuff. What if we did this? Oh, we don't have enough army XP for that. That's fine. We'll have enough of that to throw on those equipment pieces. That would be okay. Uh, is it time to go to war? It's probably time to go to war. Any air support? Let's see. Ground support. I'm going to have you guys hold. Boom, boom, boom. Well, I guess it's time we could try. Grab some decryption. That'd be great. Oh, that is so incredibly weak. Hold on, before we go to war, do they have any more divisions we can take? No. Oh, crap. That is not ideal. You know what? I'm going to send you right here, too, then. All right. You are the one down here, right? Uh, Army 2, 13. No. There you go. Uh, I might recommend you go up here, just because that's probably a little bit better for that. 
Yeah, just join this army. Stay up there, because that's going to get hit pretty hard, probably. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Screw it. Let's go to war. Go to war and see what happens. The leader of River Coalition will not capitulate unless every other member has capitulated. Oh, crap. That's not good. Uh... Oh, oh, maybe they should stop training. Oh, goodness. Alright, so, Benton Land's called other people in. Anything going on? Not yet. Uh, well, let's see. You know what? I'm going to divide you guys up a little better. There you go. If you need to go somewhere, go ahead and do it. The Empire Strikes Back seems there's, there's little hope for the Empire. Oh. Wow. Griffon and the Empire is looking pretty good for themselves. Pretty good. All right, let's go do this and go to war. Kind of, we could go to total mobilization, but we don't have any manpower, or pony power for that. So that'll be fine. Keep building up the forts. At least we have a good area to fall back upon. That's kind of nice. Could we win here? Maybe. Maybe push them over the river. That'd be a good goal. Uh, can you? Oh, you're not in the war. Oh, our guys are. Neither of our guys are in the war. Okay, that actually makes that actually makes a lot of sense. Uh, Barad, they they lost a lot of guys. Wow. Actually, if I don't call them into the war, that means we have to fight through this little territory first. Okay, you know what? Maybe we'll try that. Screw it. If that's all we need, and we don't have to actually defend this area. Huh. Okay, well, we can try it. Give it a little bit more time. We can try that. 1.07, that's fine. 69 factories, nice. All of you guys attack here. You attack, and then you attack as well. Could we win? Maybe? Hopefully? I don't know. Australian guards. 75, 74. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Those tanks are pretty tanky. And, oh man, our infantry is getting smashed to bits. We can pierce them, though. So, it doesn't look like... Oh, crap, there goes the Majocracy. And now they're attacking us. Oh, boy. Help them out. We're not going to call anyone else in for now. You know what? Send you guys. You're a little weaker. That's fine. Oh boy, that's not looking good down here. You guys should be able to win. Oh, uh, I didn't realize that I was actually going to be able to do something like this. That's good. More tungsten bolts are nice. Engineers, land auction. We want to grab that too. So the creation of a dedicated engineer corps within our army could prove highly beneficial. After all, there are always going to be need for to ford rivers, construct fortifications, build trenches, and traverse some difficult terrains. Cool. Uh, I didn't realize that these guys would be getting smashed so hard over here. Hey, we can get some atomic research. That's nice. Yeah, that's, that's okay to do right there. Maybe some more radar? Maybe? Cool. Yeah, we're getting pierced through there, which really sucks. That really, really sucks. Yeah, if I call in one, they're going to call all the rest in. So we're not going to call either one in. That would not be very good. Oh, but we do have enemy fighters that we're trying to beat up. Go and do that, too. That's okay. More divisions? Ah, oh, yes. So you guys are over there. That's fine. I want to attack and succeed, but I'm not really sure where to attack. I could try this, maybe. They are definitely entrenched. Yeah, there's no way we can attack. We gotta wear them out first, then. All right. I'll go right there. Then. That's fine. Oh, Willow Moss, Infantry Expert. That'd be good. What if we took one of you guys away? Nothing happens. Okay, what if we... Hmm. Focused here very intently. We're going to need more fuel. Decryption. Okay, cool. Uh, after that, get some more artillery. That'd be good. Advanced artillery would be awesome. Uh, I doubt we could really win here again. We threw everyone in there right now. They are very heavily entrenched. And they must have air superiority. Or none. Why are we always losing? Marigold? How are we... I don't really understand. How are we losing with... Well, I mean, we don't have air superiority, I suppose. But still. That shouldn't really make a huge difference. Well, at least we built a good fort line. Ah, that sucks. If we did that... Would they be able to attack us, maybe? Banner Engineers. 
grab some more field hospitals. Do we have field hospitals on our guys already? Yeah, we do. That's good. Oh, come on, guys. Come attack me. No? Alright, well, whatever. Ah, uh, man. This kind of sucks. This really does suck. I'm going to go ahead and get better planes. No, we already did that. We're going to get better tactical bombers next. Because there's no way I can pierce over there. No way I can break their lines, which is really stupid. Uh, wing body. We grab two things of fuel. That'd be good. Right, do we have any extra planes just sitting around? Yes, we do, actually. Cool. Split you guys in half, and boom. I'm gonna have you guys do that, and then another 200. Cool. Whenever you're ready. And we could try attack again with air superiority, but we'll see what happens. I doubt it'll do that well. Give us a little more time. I'm gonna use a little. 60 is not bad. With air superiority, can we actually. Right? Hold on. Why, why is this organization so low? 43. Fight for the prince. Military and power. That is. That organization is what's killing us off right now. Uh, that's so not good. Support the attack if you can. Support the attack if you can. Come on. Because with that air superiority, we can win. Oh, man. I don't like how low organization we have. But mature our doctrine. The f training of fresh divisions and construction of a new equipment is all well and good. However, the impact of a larger army will be significantly weakened if we don't have the doctrine to properly utilize them. As such, we must create a dedicated high command and have them develop Lake City's doctrine for future conflicts ahead. That'd be good. Oh, are we missing something? Oh, low pony power. That's pretty normal. We actually took a piece of territory. Wow. This is, this is different. Get him in there, get him in there. Throw that division in there too, come on. Don't lose it, don't lose it. We fought too long and hard for this. We've lost a lot of guys. Oh, we did, oh, the broad, oh, they finally capitulated, okay. We've lost a lot of guys in this so far. Oof. Peace conference, oh, wow. Oof, all right, let's see. We're gonna do something like that next. Push him over river, hopefully. See what happens. Good. War bonds would not be bad either. Eh, go ahead and do that. Keep building yourselves up. Ooh, we want to get a refinery, don't we? Yes, please. Ah, uh, yes. Weak body, yes. Maybe get some radar as well. Maybe get some better radar after that. That'd be kind of nice. Capone Empire, Serene Republic, huh? Cool. And let's see. That is still over here. Are they, are they trying to bomb us, huh? All right, well, whatever. If that's the case. Hit those enemy planes back. All right, another division, good. Azure is going to be really the kind of the special uh, the divisions we send in to kill all the enemies. Great. All right, let's see what, can, what happens when we can do this. Well, I like it's going better using. You know what? Using an air force actually does help. Go figure. Who would have thought? You know? Who would have thought? Good. Oh, now they're attacking us. Oh boy. Are they going to be able to hold here? Maybe not. Maybe not. Hold on. Mechanized offensives. Good. Airline battle is always nice to see, but we don't have tanks. That doesn't really help us that much. You get five more organization for everyone. Soft attack. Recon for your recon. More Ten more organization for infantry, which is what we desperately need right now. Shock and all is just too good to not not use. We're gonna need more fuel too. Oof. Nice. Come on guys, hold out, hold out. Force oh wait, that's force attack. Oh, plus stand force Oh yeah, it probably costs a lot less than to do it now. If that's the case, I'm gonna send you over here too. I'm gonna send you right here to help out. Get down there, get down there. Cause they're destroying our strength right now. Oh man, this is. There's a lot of battles going on down here. I'm glad I did not call my other allies in. Oof. Oh, there we go. Phew, that's not looking good for Deponia's soldiers. Whoopsie. My bad. Oh, they're still attacking. Oh boy. I'm going to call you. Move over here. You're going to need it. Losses. Well, came to Vadina. 40,000 versus. Well, that's not bad. 79,000. That's not bad. Those poor Deponia soldiers. Poor, poor soldiers. Oh well. 
Oh, guys. Wing Barty. I know you're like Italy, but please. Please don't do that. Stuff like this. You're making yourself look foolish. Actually. That looks a little better. Oh yeah, just kill yourselves on the line, guys. That's exactly what we wanted. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, that's oh they've doubled our casualties now. That's so good. Make sure our doctrine, great. Let's establish the Lake City Air Corps probably next. Traditionally, our limited stock of aircraft have been put under the Army's command. However, examples from the Changeling Kingdom and Equestria have shown how much efficiency can be gained once the Air Force is separated into, into its own branch. As such, we will follow these examples and formally create the Lake City Air Corps. Great. Now I need to use these guys because to cut off like these guys over here so we can circle some divisions, that'd be kind of good. Field hospitals are awesome though. Happy 1014. I just realized it, it is 1014 right now. Please just give me one moment. Oh, wing body, why are you doing that? Oh my goodness. My apologies, and they're beating us up down here very strongly. That's not good. Uh, you have to hold out some more. Uh, at this point, if that's going to be the case, I'm going to concentrate forces right here so we can encircle these guys. This is not good. This is not good. Get down here, too. Get back in there. Good. Good. Get those six divisions all down here so we gotta, we got to strike quick and fast. Can use more stability. Aircraft designer. Uh, we need to do this. 20% agility. 10% more for kit fighters is so good. that We need that. Uh, division speed wouldn't be bad either, actually. But we're going to grab more ground support, probably, because that looks seems pretty good. Attack. Eh, that's not bad either. We'll go with this one. Oh, crap. Now we lost the support. That sucks. Cool. All right. So you guys down here yet? No. It's fine. It's fine. If I leave... That's not going to be good for those soldiers. That's okay. Give them just a little bit more organization first. Come on, come on. Get some more organization. Three. Oh, God. Yeah, I knew that this would happen as soon as I would leave that tile. That sucks. Retreat over here because I don't want to lose this. You cannot afford to lose it. Advanced artillery. Good. 10-14. Grab even better artillery to hit them even harder. Don't even make it. Just do that a little better. There we go. And actually, garrison-wise, so on. Since we can afford it, an armored car. There we go. That should help out at least a little bit, right? Nice. Can we smash this way? That'd be great if we could. Yes, yes. We're fighting even into the hills, and we're doing okay. Improved radar. Get even better radar. Because I want to build up better, 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 better radar so we can figure out where the enemies are at, what we can do against them. Come on. Oh, wait, we lost. Well, send you guys in then. There you go. Oh, now they're attacking us across the entire line. That's not good. Send half you guys over here. No longer get anti-Griffin propaganda, so be it. Oh, we're actually going to lose some population then. Oh, that's not good. So, hey, we got in there. Great. Get in there. Come on. Oh, we lost a tile. That's not good. Don't lose a tile. No, 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 no. Good. Actually... Could we get down here more quickly? Could we move into here quickly? Could you keep these guys in place? If we can get down here, that'd be great. Lake Festival? Uh, I think we already read this. Yeah, we've already read this every single time, so. Oh, crap. They got in there. Crap. That's not good. Oh, uh, yeah. There's nothing we can do about that. That's the case. Just help support the attack this way. Crush them. We can encircle two tiles. That'd be great. Ah, oh, we've done it, my friends. We have encircled two enemy tiles. Which is three plus three is usually six. I can sometimes do math. Oh, you got... No, you got to hold out. You're going to hold out until you die. There we go. There we go. Let's get in there. Oh, we overran a few... Did we overrun a couple divisions or did they overran us? Well, that's not good, regardless. Uh, get those guys in there immediately. No. Okay, then you're gonna go this way. No, you hold. Hold. And now you gotta go retreat. God dang it. Maybe not. Oh, you go this way then. Good. Let's see. 10, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 
15, 10, 14. Oh, let's go back down here. Let's get some more dispersed industry. Even though we don't need it, it helps us with our population, I think, if I remember correctly. Let's grab that. We get we need to do some uh, air docking, too. That'd be good. Slowly but surely winning. Great. We've done it. We've taken them out. Ooh, had definitely a cost to us. Oh, my goodness. That's not good. Definitely a strong cost to everything that we're doing here. We've lost 75,000, but we've killed off a quarter million. So we're slowly doing okay by only focusing on our little land border between us and the enemy. Wow, those guys are not looking good from the Kingdom of Wittenland. I wonder if they're actually using, um... What is it called? Uh, Charge? New Sky Navy of Burns? Oh, that's okay. I wonder if they're using uh, that one doctrine. Actually, you could probably go like there. Maybe? That'd be kind of cool. Force attack. Why can I not think of that? Yeah, they really don't like us here. That's okay. I don't really like them either. Even, uh, yeah, Vinland still not looking good. That's fine with me. At least we kind of have a fallback line. That's kind of nice, though. Having a fallback line. That's good. That's some good stuff. Alright, so this is all up here, which is good. All up until this river. So we have air support for days. Can we win there, maybe? House of Avian? No. It looks like we can't. That sucks. Uh, attacking over the river is always garbage. I mean, if you want to keep attacking, man, go right ahead. Make my day. Even over here, you're, you're going to make my day. Oh, boy. Smash into these guys. Oh, uh, Lake City Air Corps. That's nice. Let's go ahead and do... Ooh, design company. Ah, uh, this one is what we want to do. Jizzergrad Aluminum and Steel Association. The Jizzergrad Aluminum and Steel Association is one of Lake City's most powerful guilds, holding monopoly upon the production of steel and aluminum. They're also responsible for producing our current fi fighter fleet. If we were to expand our contract with them, they would be justified in opening an airplane factory, greatly increasing both the quantity and quality of our planes. Yes. Oh, they don't like... Ooh, I don't like that. I don't like that. You guys lead the attack now. Good, we kicked him out. And we have another river to defend with. That's good. Because we're going to attack here, and then we're going to maybe swing around to high main. High main. Something like that. Because I just can't break over that river. And they can't break over the river for us, too, for the most part. So, that's good. Oh, my goodness. How many have we killed? Vittenland, almost 200,000. Not bad. More divisions, good. Just put them on this army now. I want to put more uh, normal divisions, not puppet divisions over here, but whatever. Uh, okay, well, whatever. More artillery? Yes, please. Nothing over here. That's fine. Over here, no, 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 no. Uh, you know what? We might put some, you know, let's get some signal companies. I never use signal companies. Actually, I do use them more often. I have been using them more and more often, so let's use them. Looks like we might be able to use, We might need some more guns, actually, so we'll do that. Let's throw on, at least for the garrisons, a little bit more armored cars. Actually, if I replace that, how much would we need? We still have more than enough. That'll be good. Good. Are we poised to... Oh. Well, we're kind of poised to strike, but the enemies are kind of striking us right now. Oh, my goodness. They're doubling down now. Oh, boy. You got to hold. That is very, very not good. Just like Vittenland soldiers. Not good. And then take all but two, you go there, and then take all but one, and go right there if you can. Can we do that right here? With enough air superiority, because we have 269. Nice. Air XP. Could we win right here? Could you guys win right here? Could y'all come right there? Good. Uh, we didn't win right there just yet, that's fine. Uh, I'm going to take you guys to do that now. You're going to help support the attack if you can. Up right there. At, at this point, it doesn't really matter. Just kill them off here. Please, 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 please. Oh, military police three. Great. So he has more on uh, manpower. Pony power. Let's grab some more construction speed and maybe we'll do some more extraction. That'd be very good to do as well. Take high main. Get down there. Move, 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 move. Force the attack. Fall of Griffin Stone. Cool. I just want to make an encirclement. God dang it. Okay, well, if they want to do that, then uh, I'll go right here then. Oh crap. That's not good. High main. Get him out. Get him out. Oh, boy. 
Things are getting crazy down there. And uh, the Griffin Griffonian Empire. Let's grab some of this. That'd be good. Even more radar. Maybe a little bit more fuel. I better start running out of fuel at some point. Our civilian factories to get more fuel. Oh, there goes Griffin Stone. All right then. Might as well do that as well. Uh, let's see. So we gotta stop extending this way. We still gotta start encircling more. We've lost 100,000 soldiers. We've lost about half a million. Not bad, not bad. Stretch out our lines quite a bit here. Uh, let's see. I'm probably gonna attack this area next. These two tiles are gonna be key for what we need. I'm gonna put you here just in case. Centralized fire control for even more soft attack. Let's grab some forward observers for even more recon and reinforce rate. I love it. Oh, another soldier here. Throw them on. That's fine, that's fine. They are looking really weak in some areas, and they still attack me. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Willow Moss has been wounded. That's not good. Uh, we probably actually need to build up an airbase, actually, of all things. Let's do it right here. There you go. <clears throat> very good, very good. Looking pretty decent so far. Doing better than I initially thought, but still, could be better. Uh... Oh, yeah, look at another military factory. Nice. The opening of the Jizzergrad Aluminum and Steel Association's fighter factory puts Lake City on the map as a leading producer of airplanes within Eastern Griffonia. This complex will not only employ clo close to 2,000 ponies, but also go a long way in arming our burgeoning Lake City Air Corps. Yes, please. And we have now just enough to do this. Our fighters get even more agility. 20% instead of 10%. That's so nice. Go on and put, put them out of uh, their misery. Oh, look at that. Vittenland. Oh, who's that other division? Nimbusia. Oh, they're not doing good either. Nice. I don't know how much manpower these these uh, places have because I never plays them. I played Bakarin Republic once, but that's all I really know. Now that we have that tile, where do I attack next? I need to break over the river. Probably right here. I'm waiting for the divisions to get over here first. Uh, well, since actually, you know what? Just in case, we're going to push these guys out of here first. Just this tile. Because it won't matter if we come from here to there. That'll help protect ma high main a little better. Yes, guys, if you want to help out, that's great. Whatever way allows me to destroy more enemy divisions or just manpower it will be great. Actually, we've not really killed off that many from the Bakarn Republic or the River Republic, which is fine, but still. Alright, let's go and do this. Force the attack. Only cost us 12, that's so good. I want to see absolute destruction of enemy forces right here, right now. Just shrek their buttholes. Please get in there, please get in there. Nice, good. Oh, that's so nice. We could... Uh, when, wing body is just so large, it's going to be hard to actually, like, cut them down to size. But let's grab some more rubber first, so we can get out of our deficit of rubber. And aluminum, that'd be good. We'll do some more extraction after that one. Good. No, they're stopped attacking us, which is fine with me. I don't really care. Over here, we got to do this. we got to break over the river. Get over here so we can get up there. Can't quite cut these guys off, but that's okay. Because this is looking a little bad. we got to get rid of these guys, too. Breaking over here will be nearly impossible for us. But if we can push up this way, push up that way, I think that would be kind of okay for us. Cool. As long as we don't lose what we've gained so far. Yeah, oh, my, they just keep attacking and attacking and attacking. Gotta love it, right? 816,000, even better radar. Let's go and grab some extraction. I think we have enough radar for now. Uh, that's not bad. How are we building? Even better. Start doing some more fuel so we don't have to trade it away all the time. Actually, oh, that's already level 10. That's good. That's good stuff. Alright. Force the attack. They were pretty weak, so. Send half you guys up there to Buckthorn. That'd be nice. Armored cars looking great. Let's go ahead and do just pretty much convert them all, probably. There you go. Let's see what happens. 1500, not bad. Oh, crap. Don't get encircled, though, guys. Come on. Good. By doing this, I really, really want to see um, that the uh, enemies just attack us more and more here. That's what I want them to attack. Just attack, 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 attack. Level 3, level 4 attack. Azure is looking great. Does Cold do have anything for us? Yes. Even more attack? Yes. We're going to actually get some more recovery. Uh, hmm. Let's get some recovery rates so they are always able to move more and more and more. 
Ooh, nice. This looks pretty good. Prioritize aluminum for fighters. The Lake City is poor in aluminum, relying heavily upon imports from other nations in order to make up for its deficits. This lack of aluminum is especially worrying to our Air Force due to the heavy use of the metal within advanced aircraft designs. By prioritizing the Air Force, when it comes to allotting our aluminum reserves, we can ensure that we would never run short on fighters. But unfortunately, I will be right back. All right, my friends. Sorry about that, but I had to go... Uh Basically, put some more clothes on because where I live right now, it's very cold at the time of this recording. Regardless, we still have some more military factories to use. We're out of aluminum, unfortunately. I don't want to do this because we still need to keep making more and more planes. But, yeah, if we had fighters doing that, that'd be okay. We have we don't even have enough steel now. Wow. We got some crystals now. We got some fuel. Oh, I'm not really sure. I just put them on fighters, I guess. We have 1.06. Oh, that, that even made it worse. Oh, but whatever. It is what it is. We need to get some more aluminum. Uh, I don't mind trading maybe a way for... Uh, actually, you know what? Nope. I love Kingdom Wing Body. There we go. Slightly better. Slightly, slightly, slightly better. Now there's going to be attacking our time, our guys the entire time, hopefully. In which we killed off so many of them. Oh, don't lose it. Don't lose it. Oh, we're actually... Ooh, what's happening down there? Oh, Signal Company's nice. Go ahead. By go ahead, I mean us. It's 1014. 1014. Eh, grab some more radar because we can. Why not? Cool. And since we're here, how much support can we, we have? 1.5 thousand. What if we made these guys have some signal companies? We have plenty of motorized and support equipment to afford this. Manpower is slowly going to get lower and lower, but that's okay. That's uh, actually improve our division's capabilities in the field. I would love to be able to strike into here, but I really doubt we would be able to. I'm really tempted to call in my allies so we can attack from this side, but then they're going to come in and just smash the living hell out of us. So we can't do that yet. We cannot do that just yet. Prioritize this, and then do that one as well. That'd be good. Uh, radar, looking good. It's construction 5, awesome. Let's grab some more extraction now. Excavation 2 is good. Yeah, they're looking really weak in some areas. I want to attack here and then maybe over here, maybe? Because breaking over that river is going to be nearly impossible. So, we're going to do this. All but you are going to attack here. Take one division attack here as well. Is that enough? So, if you just support the attack here, if you can. Forward observers, great. Even more reinforce rate and reconnaissance? Yes, please. Advanced fire bases, more organization and recovery rate? Yes, yes, yes. Help out for now. Help out for now. Push them out, push them out. I would love to get over here, but we can't get over here yet. Uh, we really have to make an encirclement right here. But that's fine, that's fine, it's fine. What we're going to do, though, is do this. And we will attack a little crazy, like, either into one of these two areas. Hopefully. Uh, that being said, we will have to convert some of these guys. Fighter wings. Uh, actually, your army, too. Uh, you know what? How many more planes do we have? We have a few more fighters we could throw on here. Let's stop them, stop them from bombing the garbage out of us. And destroy their planes, please. Please destroy their planes. Now we've got 200 fighters, hopefully doing better over here. I need more tactical bombers. They're still attacking us like crazy. Oh yeah, keep attacking, keep attacking. Over here is very weak. Oh boy, this is a bad idea. I know this is a bad idea. Can we actually do it though? Yes, yes. Please, please do it. Please be able to do this. We're going to go and throw another division right here. That'd be great. Oh my goodness. If you can get over there, force the attack. Oh, we might just be able to do it. Actually, can you guys help out as well? Oh, you can't. Oh, yeah, they're done. We're going to circle all these guys. Yes. Oh, we did it. We did it. We did it. We did it. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. That is usually 4 plus 4 is 8. 8 plus 3 is usually 11, 14. And that's 16 divisions, I think? Nice. Great. Oh, don't, don't lose. You cannot afford to lose. Defend, defend, defend. Oh, we did it. Hold on, hold on. Begin attacking. Weaken them, weaken them. Come on. Oh my goodness, that was a great, tremendous instrument that we've done here. Oh, come on, keep attacking, keep attacking. Oh, actually, I'm going to put you guys right here. Improve rubber. It's great. Even more extraction. Even more. More, 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 more. Come on. Get in here, too. Get in here. This is good. Good stuff. And... They're gone. Beautiful. Oh, my goodness. We lost quite a few guys, but we've done a very good job so far. 
Prioritize aluminum fighters for or aluminum for fighters. That's good. Go ahead and do fighter models. Eh, I want to do some more fighter models. The Jezergrad Aluminum and Steel Association has established a dedicated R&D facility on the outskirts of Jezergrad. This location will prove vital in developing, designing, and testing new aircraft technologies. Very good. Nope. You're not coming in yet. I refuse to let you. Uh, we're going to do this one just because I'm, I'm going to research more steel and stuff like that. Uh, yeah, Wing Body, don't worry about that. Yeah, just don't worry about that at all. All right, so now... We're gonna go for. We're gonna attack these two tiles. We're gonna take even more of wing body. Uh, actually, no. Just everyone here first, and they go. Wee. And we will have to raise a conscription level next because it's we're getting too low. Wow. As much as I want to just kill them off right now, which we might be able to, I'd rather just encircle and destroy them. Go ahead. There you go. Force the attack. You might as well. Azure. Azure. I forget how you pronounce it. It's fine. Whatever. Just go ahead. See what you can do. Heck, if anything, you get you guys probably do the same thing right here. Speed it up a little bit more. There you go. It's not a huge victory here for encircling, encircling divisions, but whatever. There you go. Cool. They're very weak. That's good. I guess we get thrown right there. I'm going to probably make an encirclement up here if we can, too. Better radar. Why not? 1015. Happy 1015, my friends. A new year, new us. Let's grab some more research speed. Colossus series. You guys, come here. Good. Alright, so at this point... Uh, like, uh, I want to attack more up north because there's so much land down in Vintland. We have to start destroying the enemy, more and more enemy, enemy, enemy divisions, enemy, enemy, enemy. We might be able to go that way, maybe. I don't think we will really be able to. Uh, you know what? Oh, actually, don't do that. Uh, let's do that. What do you like this? Here we go. I'm not sure. Can we actually make them all one? Huh. Well, we could try, I suppose. Let's try it like this. Can we do the entire front that way? Yes, we can. Oh, that's good. That's so good. As long as we don't give up that much territory, that'll be okay with me. Good, good, good. Whew. This has been a very violent episode, I'd say. Very violent. Very, very violent. Uh, you know what? We could probably just... Eh, if I push them out, then we're going to need more divisions to help take this area. i would do it anyways. Force the attack. Kill them all off. There you go. That's what we like to see. Nope. Oh, Air Doctrine. Air Doctrine. I keep forgetting to do Air Doctrine. I was so tempted by Extraction. But that's good. Let's go ahead and do some more air doctrine. Uh, we have tactical bombers, so we'll use operational integrity. That'd be great. Oh, yeah, now they're attacking us like crazy again. Keep it up, guys. See what you can do. Which is nothing. 32,000 manpower, that's obviously not good for us, but we'll see what happens very soon. Because we've got to get, raise our conscription level even higher. Higher, higher, higher. Extraction 3, great. Need less aluminum, or I guess rubber, really. Good. Actually, I'm going to grab that other thing of aluminum then. Nice. What are we building? More roads. That's fine. Over here. Do we have any more planes? Yes, we do. Good, good, good. Uh, I do want to break over here, so we're going to have to do that, unfortunately. And then, no, you guys. 200 more planes. 200 more fighters. Yes, yes. Cut you dice in half. There you go. See what you can do. I want to attack over here, but they, they, they probably know that I want to attack. If that's the case, I'll put the attack right here. They have low organization, so that's good for me. And good for us. Ooh. You're all poisoned. Fight over the river. If you can force the attack... Oh, they, oh my goodness. You guys can actually win pretty easily then. Nice. Is that, is that the river? That's a river republic. They're not doing well anymore, which is good. If that's the case, I'm going to see if we can do this. Go even higher up. If we go to Cultivac, that'd be great. All but, eh, all but one. I love it when they attack so harshly that they can't do too much against us. Eh, that's okay. We'll do this one next. 
Nejima has shown interest in merging with the Jezzer Gretel armaments, the nation's leading producer of munitions, as an aspect of this merger would see the development of bombing ordnance and aircraft under a single roof. By consenting to this merger, our government would see an immediate benefit to bomber development as the two teams collaborate on current and future projects. Sounds pretty good to me. Come on, get in there so we get attacked a little bit more. Advanced fire bases, even more organization. Yes, please. And now we get some shock and awe. More soft attack. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, they did not like that. They really did not like that. But I like that. I like that a lot. Oh, yeah. We're coming for your River Republic. Ace pilot promoted. Great. Yeah, we're going to need more manpower. An unfortunate but necessary evil. Oh, okay, that's pretty big. Excavation 1. Uh, air doctrine is still looking okay-ish. Yeah, that's a little bit ahead of time. How about we grab some... Ah, more soft attack. 10%, Jesus. For other things, 5% for infantry, so that's fine. Oh, you need a field marshal, actually. Uh, yeah, that's not bad. Uh, uh, well, maybe not. Maybe I don't want it. Yeah, I think it'll be okay. I love Logistics Wizard. Offensive. Yes. And then we'll do infantry stuff. He is like an old guard or whatever, but, you know, whatever. Nope. Nope. I will call them in soon enough, because we will probably do a general attack eventually. Wow, we can actually see their forces. A little strange. Actually, we might be able to call everyone in now. But nah, the, the line is still kind of weak. I'm going to wait. I'd rather be secure in our victory than anything else. So. Man, some of these divisions, they just keep attacking and attacking. Can we actually win there? No. That's okay. Hold for now. Ace pilot promoted. Very good. You know what? If they keep attacking, no problem for us. Uh, fighter baiting. I love fighter baiting. You get almost two army, two air XP a day. Jesus. Very good. 23,000 manpower. Not bad. Not great. Cool. And, yeah, I mean, they're getting really weak. The only one that's not really attacking too much is the Kingdom of Lu Lushi. I thought we had an agreement earlier, Lushi. I guess not. Good. Even more, oh, we need to get more attack now. That is very nice. Anyone else over here? Not really. And I doubt it. Cool. Did you guys win now, maybe? Support the attack a little bit more? Maybe, maybe not. Nope. Couldn't win quite there just yet. That's okay. If that's the case, I'm going to say half of you guys come right here. Help support the attack, maybe? Support the attack, maybe? Keep breaking down those tanks. If we can, maybe? We can pierce them. New Maryland is gone. Great, great, great. They keep throwing more divisions. This is a mountainous province. Oh, we can't actually win there. That sucks. Force the attack. Come on, force it. Force them to die on the hill. Oh, that's nice. Even though we're, t we're t suffering casualties, don't get too, don't get me wrong, but... Good. Open up their lines a little bit more. Come down here, maybe over here, maybe... Yeah, that's, that's worthwhile. We could try that. Come on. I, ah, man, getting this would be so good, but we can't quite do that yet. Nope. Resistance. How, how bad is resistance right now? Can't be that bad. Like festival, great. I'm not sure we find all this money to do it, but okay. We're starting to run out of divisions because people aren't moving around too much. Cool. Move around a little bit more if you need to. Good. And then we'll do. Uh, we could do that one. Military factory. Let's do that one. So. Nejima is one of Lake City's leading automobile producers, holding a significant hold upon the production of cars, trucks, gasoline, and rubber within our nation. They also have the only government contract for producing and maintaining our tiny fleet of bombers. If we were to increase our demand for the product, this would likely push them into establishing a dedicated aircraft factory. Cool. And we'll end the episode very soon. I know this video's gone on for quite a while, but I want to make a, maybe one more supplement. Oh, goodness gracious. We got to go to all adult serve. That's really going to hurt us, but we kind of are forced to do it right now. Ooh. Go right there, go right there to there, if we can. Just one more. One more. Come on. Immediately attack. You should be able to win immediately, basically. There's no way they can attack us on the hill. Stop us. Actually, they might have more uh, planes now. Huh. Good. Could you immediately attack down here and then do this as well with support from these guys? Actually, are you winning right there? Wow. Cool. Keep going. Keep going. We want to circle up. We've got it. We've got it. 
Great. Help support the attack right here. That'd be awesome. Help support the attack. Oh, they took that tile back. Whatever. A, we got this tile though. But we're going to end today's episode here. Just because I'm going to play this a little bit off screen. Just so we can speed things up a little bit more. But I hope you enjoyed today's episode. It took us a while, but regardless, we did really well. If you enjoyed it, like I said, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow when we will have capitulated, or will capitulate, the rest of the River Coalition. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.